technology? Well, I, I think it's being more on the technical side. Yeah. If we're talking about film director, uh -huh. if you're talking about theater, then then it's more uh, creative. Yeah. There are only like there are only two true uh, authors. You know, it's the author of the script and the author of music. You know? Yeah. And uh, the director is not among them. No. When, when you have a couple of ideas, it doesn't make you an artist. You know. No. Yes. You just no, put but like you put uh, people together. You know, and if you're lucky, you have a very good crew. If you're lucky, you have a very good camera operator and if you're lucky you have good actors and uh, but if you have good actors you don't have to tell them what they should do you know it, they usually do it themselves you know okay. and, <laughs> and, I, and you do a lot of calculations also because you're always limited with money and time so all you do as a director you calculate time like will I have enough time to do this and can I substitute time with money or money for time? Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes you get more time but less money or the other way around. So, so you always balance it like this and this is the ma majority of your work as a director is you sort of balancing time against money. Well, you just get various ideas, you just put ideas together. So, yeah. so but the, the choice of location was actually the second choice. We originally wanted to shoot it in the dockyards, in the docks, in the mm -hmm. shipyards, in Gdańsk. And then the second choice was uh, the factory, actually. And, uh, but yeah, it uh, wasn't such a difficult idea. I think uh, I like factories. I always try to have a scene in a factory or a warehouse or whatever. So it was only logical that I've chosen a factory. I, I needed something very, very realistic, you know, as a background for, for this sort of play. For the first time, I came uh, six years ago, so I don't, I cannot see actually any change. I think the festival is as good as it was, you know. Uh, for me, it's the the good old same festival in Trieste, you know. But uh, <coughs> I don't think there are that many festivals in Italy like this, or maybe this is an exceptional one. You know. It's based on a strong personality of Anna Maria, of course. It, there are festival like, festivals like that, you know, that are based on one person, <coughs> strong leadership or personality. This is one of them. You know. So I, I wish them they, they go on forever. You know. This is a special place, you know, this is not Italy, this is like Austro-Hungarian yeah. or this is on the border of Slovenia, you know, so it's, so it's, it's uh, Italian Slavonic sort of, you know, uh, the history of a place is also interesting and, <clears throat> and I think it, it's only logical that you sort of bring all the elements together here at the festival because the, the town itself is composed of many foreign elements. You know. it is. Oh, yeah, but there's always been a talk about Joyce, you know, yeah, that that's, uh, remains the same, you know, whenever yeah. I come, uh, there's, there's something about Joyce. Yes, because <laughs> yeah, it's... Yeah, because it's a Joyce town. <laughs> yeah, yeah.